Now on to GM. GM is continuing to build out their electric vehicle portion of their business. And that includes working on the next gen Ultium battery design. So they're already working on a number of factories. They have a factory in Ohio. They're looking to build another factory in Tennessee. That's reportedly where the second factory is gonna be. And now they're working on a next gen Ultium battery design. And these advanced lithium batteries have greater range, they're lighter weight, lower cost, and they have a lot of other benefits for future electric vehicles. But the thing is, the first gen, like the current Ultium batteries, haven't even been released yet. So now they're talking about next gen Ultium batteries when the first ones aren't even out yet. They said that, you know, those are supposed to be released in vehicles by the end of this year, but they're already talking about next gen Ultium batteries. And they explain how to develop, to develop these improved batteries, um, they are working jointly with a company called Solid Energy Systems. This company has extensive ex experience working with lithium batteries. Um, GM Ventures, which is GM's venture capital arm, they helped bring the startup to life. They've been working with it for years, invested in it about six years ago, and now they're taking the partnership to another level because by 2023, they're planning to build a factory to develop these next-gen Ultium batteries in Woburn, Massachusetts to start making prototypes of these batteries. They said they already have prototypes of them that have withstood some 150,000 simulated miles worth of testing in laboratories in Michigan. So the design is pretty promising, but as of right now, they said that this is where they're going in the future. They said a lot of companies were looking towards solid state batteries, but they believe that this is going to be better. They said it's more practical, better performing, and it's just a better alternative than solid state batteries. They said it has greater range from batteries of the same size. They said it's lighter and the power generation from them is even more. And according to GM president, Mark Russ, in a media release, he said with its next generation Ultium chemistry, they believe they're on the cups, cusp of a once in a generation improvement in energy density and cost. And they have been behind a bit. They've been working to catch up with Tesla as fast as they can. They've been spending $28.2 billion in electric vehicles and battery production, and they are making a major push to take on Tesla in the EV space. They're still behind, but they believe that this Ultium battery that they're working on is a once in, once in a generation improvement to electric vehicles, batteries, and it's gonna be huge. They think this is gonna be a game changer. They said there's more room to improve in both categories, and they improved to they, they intend to improve at a faster at a faster rate and spend billions of dollars in order to do this, to get these vehicles to last longer, be lighter, faster, um, less expensive, and that's the goal. Batteries are the most expensive part of any electric vehicle, and they've been trying to make them more powerful, less expensive, because once they get to be less expensive, then cars become less expensive than combustion engine vehicles, and that's when we'll really see a shift for people just all over the world buying electric vehicles. Right now, it's still more expensive to make um, electric vehicle because of the battery costs, but once these are reduced, then we're gonna see more and more people buy these electric vehicles.